Greetings from Team Rex team. Today we will talk about FC United WordPress theme. Specifically, correct theme installation, activation, plugins and demo content import. I'll show you how to do this on a clean WordPress installation. In your dashboard, navigate Appearance, Add New. Then click Upload theme and choose File. You need a zip file named FC United. Next, click on the Install Now button. We will not activate it for now. Let's go to the Themes page and install our child theme the same way. Again, press Upload Theme. But this time, choose FC United Child and click Install Now. Once done, click Activate. Next, it will offer you to install ThemeRex add-ons plugin. It's a platform that puts everything together, so let's install and activate it. In the next step, you need to activate your theme. Add your name, email address, your purchase code and press the Submit button. OK, the license is activated and we are in the theme dashboard. Here you can disconnect your license if you want to transfer your site to another domain or web hosting. Start Setup Wizard. It will walk you through the setup process step by step. Or you can manage everything manually by switching between the tabs. Let's do it manually. In the Skins section, you can choose the style of your future website. By default, it's a soccer theme, so let's keep it. The Plugins section helps you to install and activate the required plugins. I want to have all the features that the theme offers, so I'll install all of them. It may take some time, so don't close your browser. OK, all the plugins were installed successfully, and we can move to the Demo Data section. You can make Partial Import or Full Dummy Data Import. Please note, the Full Import will erase all the data you currently have on your site. I will make a Full Import. It will again warn about erasing the data. Click OK. And then click on the Start Import button. The process may take some time, up to 5 minutes, so don't close your browser. And again, I want to emphasize that if you have some content on your website that you want to keep, then go with the partial import. Use full import only for new installations or when you don't want to keep your old content. Alright, the import has been completed and on the next stage you can start customizing your site. We are done. Hope this video was helpful. Please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more useful tutorials.